If you would like to use this receiver as a PPM receiver, you need to put the factory given jumper onto the third and fourth channel's signal pins, as you can see on the picture. In that case, the first channel will provide you the PPM signals. If you would like to use this receiver as a PWM receiver, you do not need to do anything, just in that case you will have only four channels. One important thing I would like to highlight here. There are two official firmwares available for this receiver. One is the 18 millisec and the other is a 27 millisec version. The, most probably your receiver is delivered with the 18 millisec um, firmware version. And let me highlight here that it basically can handle six PPM channels, so don't use more channels in that case. You have the chance to upgrade the firmware to have the 27 millisec uh, firmware on your receiver. In that case, you can securely use all eight PPM channels. To upgrade the firmware, you need to have an FR Sky USB cable, which you can see on the screen. Please subscribe, feel free to share these videos, and do not forget to raise your questions or comments. Thank you for watching.